Some say the Trump administration is expected to find new ways to continue family separations through a tweaked version of zero tolerance. It's being called the binary option because it keeps asylum-seeking families together for up to 20 days. Then parents are given a choice. One, stay in detention center together with immigration case while their immigration case proceeds. Or two, their children are put in a government shelter until sponsor is found. The zero tolerance policy sparked international outreach as infants and children were put in emergency shelters. Meanwhile, their parents were put in mass trials charged with illegal entry. Some parents were deported without their children and tonight more than 60 children have yet to be reunited.